So moving along, the next thing I would like to show what we got in the store is a trap work fast version of the fans. You probably remember we did a review of this fan almost a year ago and like first ever look on the new version. But ironically, Dasmos was the last store on the planet who actually got those fans in stock. You never know what's happening. So what I'd like to show you what coming in a in a box as usual typical for um, TFC you get a bunch of cards with personal greeting from the owners and um, obviously you have a have fan itself the same 120 millimeters foam factor the only difference from the old version is that you don't have those the rubber uh, poles anymore so it's uh, this part gone and also you have an impeller which has nine blades instead of five so um, it's push very good deal of air um, because I'm after silent build I'm not going to use those fans I'm going to use a slow version of Triworks actually but this is a pretty interesting fan if you can actually fit it in your case because of the massive size of the shovels it pushes quite a bit of the air the accessory you get, you get the sleeved, uh, black sleeved cables to power up this fan and you have uh, like quite a few bags with uh, all kind of screws which you can uh, mount either to the case itself or to the radiator and uh, a whole package is almost, almost like two pounds just because of you have so much stuff in it uh, mostly screws is the biggest weight but uh, anyways so that's the thing that we finally got in stock after like everybody else already selling them for half a year but you know you can't be always first right okay and the last thing that I'd like to show you we got uh, new reservoirs from the frozen queue and uh, they kind of look neat, so I would like to reposition camera for that and uh, get out of your view, but give you a better shot on the actual reservoirs. And uh, I think it's worth much closer look than I can show you from my hands. Here you go, there is a two custom color Frozen Q reservoirs. One is a classified red or blood red. This is a deep red UV helix, which is uh, not UV reactive. You can see the a light is inside but it doesn't really glow it just shows you really deep red color very nice one of my favorites but even more uh, that what I like is the white one white is totally like striking color and combination with the white tube and uh, white sleeved cables in a black case and everything is black I think it's probably one of the really most beautiful types of builds that possibly can be done uh, very contrast type of thing. So, Bay Reservoirs is very popular at this point. We have excellent products from Coolens, uh, Danger Dan did some products which is um, uh, wasn't pretty interesting too. Not available right now as I know. Um, also, who else is making? Uh, EK have some reservoirs as well which is um, EK Spin which is pretty popular still as well. Uh, so what Frozen Q decide to bring different from everybody else is uh, first of all it's a signature thing with uh, light and helix inside but also they wanted to give opportunity to give you uh, a po possibility to add mounting of the pump because this is one of the most popular things in water cooling area right now is they have a bay reservoir with a pump mount you merge, merge two devices in one you save space and uh, also you might have some problem with uh, getting air out of the system with the bleeding but the benefits of having one device obviously overcome anything else so they did some provisioning for opportunity to add pump and the back of the reservoir uh, they also try to make universal design so to speak and uh, you can add either DDC or D5 pump depends 
on your preference. If you don't want to add any, you just cover the hole with a stop plug, which is not provided, and uh, you're done. You just use the reservoir. So, unfortunately, I already sold out on the D5 mounts. So, all thing I can show you is a DDC mount. And uh, the design is really simple. What is really it is, is just a, basically X top or like a pump top that you're getting. So this part you see is this big o-ring. So all you do is just press it against the reservoir and this provides you with, uh, with insulation for water. On the other side you either have D5 size top or DDC like in this case. So pump is uh, mounted on top of the thing and so the whole assembly is attached to the back of the reservoir. So as simple as that. So they give you also some uh, fancy cover with frozen hue letters on it, so it's up to you if you want to use it or not. Uh, but the thing is very simple. So you have a top like device with the screws and if you have pump you can add it to the end uh, of the reservoir. I think the, the idea is pretty cool. I uh, like idea that you're not limited to choice of your uh, pump selection. So you can switch if you really want to. And um, I have a few customers who already purchased this, so this, this seems pretty popular. I haven't heard any feedback yet, so I would like to know how works the system work yeah, on the practice. But for now, that's how the new reservoirs looks. Uh, the colors, standard colors, is as usual: UV blue, UV green. Uh, UV red and uh, I believe amber which is like kind of orange yellowish color this is a standard colors um, the any other colors is a custom you need to make special order I think white and uh, classified red is most interesting other colors uh, some people order different color helixes like one helix one color other is other so it's 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 all can be managed but the standard offering as I said so that's what we have for Frozen Q. Uh, I have some more products, but I think it's too much to cram in one long video. So I'll, I'll try to make another video for other new stuff. So thank you for watching. I appreciate everybody who keep coming to my channel and patient with me while I'm absent for weeks sometimes. And uh, appreciate your support, guys. Uh, see you soon.